Hey guys, this will be the easiest way to download a Strafe RGB profile. First you want to open up your utility engine and make sure it looks like this. If it doesn't look like this, you need to update your utility engine or completely uninstall it and then reinstall it by going to their website. Just put in Google, just put in Corsair Utility Engine and it'll pop up all the different keyboards. Click on whatever keyboard you have which is straight RGB from me and then download it. You should come to a page that looks like this. It'll have all of this stuff up here. All this stuff that you don't need. Now what you need to do first off is come over here and click on show only connected devices because if you don't it'll change your profile not only for your keyboard but also for your mouse and I have no idea why it does this but it does and it's very annoying. So next thing you want to do is go to their website. You want to go to the Google search bar wherever you have it and start putting in strafe RGB profiles. Click on the first link, go halfway down the page and click on whatever keyboard you have and now you'll see all of these profiles. Find one that you like there's a whole bunch of them, 19 pages of them. Click on it. Click on download. It'll probably prompt you to sign in. Go ahead and sign in and then go ahead and click the download again if it doesn't already download for you. And don't touch anything else. Don't move the file. Don't do anything. And the reason for that is the file is a .q profile extension and it's very unique so when you go to import that will be the only file that pops up. So next you want to go to your utility engine. You want to click on your keyboard. You want to click up here. It might say whatever profile you have. It might say default. Go ahead and click on that and you'll see these three little bars pop up. Go down to these two arrows, import export. Change export to import. Select file, browse and then go to your downloads folder and you'll see all of these profiles well th those will be the only ones that pop up because of these unique extensions so go ahead and click on the one you want to import click on that one import and you'll see it pops up in your profiles now say that you do this and you see nothing's happening on my keyboard there's no lights coming up nothing you might come to some of these and it's not exactly what you thought it would be it's different the only thing you have to do is come up here, click advanced, and all of your customizations will pop up. I hope that helped guys. If you run into any other problems, let me know. I ran into quite a few. So if you're one of those people that also ran into it, let me know and I'll be sure to solve it for you. Thanks guys. Bye.